Here is a follow-up from my NASA space suits video. I was told by a subscriber that a person in a space suit is in a sealed microclimate pressurized to about 5 pounds per square inch. I checked online and he was a little over, it's about 4.7 so on that I wanted to see what that small amount of pressure inside a space suit would feel like, so, as I have a garage full of bike stuff, I found just what I needed, a motorcycle inner tube, as you see I placed this in the arm of my leather jacket, and with my new trusty car pump tried to get to the 4.7 pounds of pressure. It would help if I attached it correctly to start with, so let's start again. I only need to get to 4.7 pounds so this shouldn't take long, as you see the arm is slowly inflating. Nothing registering as yet, let's pump some more. But the arm is starting to look a little rigid though. Still nothing yet, not even a couple of pounds pressure, but the arm is now very stiff and I can't see how anyone would be able to work in a suit with it ballooned out like this. Space suits are not designed for a vacuum, I have not even reached the correct pressure a space suit needs and it's already totally rigid, you would not be able to do anything in a suit that has 4.7 pounds of pressure inside. Whether you are in a vacuum or not, 4.7 pounds is 4.7 pounds, there were no moon landings, look at all their wrinkly suits, there are no spacewalks, they are all done in a large pool of water, are you all that blind, or do you love science fiction that much, what was it NASA has just come up with in the news, wait for it, they said, they want to hang buildings off of asteroids orbiting the earth, come on can't you see how they are completely taking you all for complete idiots. Do you not even question that?